High traders S&P 500 gained 0.8% last week and the first quarter finished up by 5.5%. After an 8-year bull market rally, the market is trading at an average of 22 earnings multiply and that is 30% above the 15 average. The end of the quarter also means the end of the window dressing period where the institutions try to keep the market up in order to display high quarterly returns. Now, at the open of the new quarter, we only need a trigger. Now, will it be another Trump political failure, maybe the employment report on Friday, or possibly Trump's meeting with the Chinese president this week? We will have to wait and see. Let's take a technical view of the market. As we take a look at the S&P 500, we can see that the decline that started two weeks ago was in fact stopped in the past week. Now, it is quite common that the market is resting before a big move. So whether it's going to be a continuation of the decline, as I think it will be, or another upside move, we'll have to wait and see. Again, institutional traders can start selling this week. So I think it's going to be very interesting. Let's take a look at last week picks. AAOI was my first pick last week. It had a great upside 9% move, which gave us plenty of time to take our first target partial. However, the last quarter is out due to the fact that it moved back to the entry point. So great trigger in AAOI, but no continuation. My second pick last week was HDS short. Now it looks like it had a great trigger, however it gapped down. So I never swing trade a stock that is gapping down. It moved beyond my trigger point, therefore no trade in HDS. Let's have two picks for this week. My first pick for the week is CBOE long over $81.36. CBOE is the option exchange in Chicago, US, and the trend looks just amazingly nice. Take a look at the weekly too, because it in fact looks even better than that. So CBOE for long. My second pick for the week is ABBV short under $65, a pharmaceutical, a biopharmaceutical uh, company same place Chicago US and it looks like it's a bit extended to the upside I think it is about to pull back down so ABBV short under $65 I wish you a great reading week and see you next week Traders, I would love to hear your thoughts regarding this video, so let's have a discussion in the comments below. And if you are not subscribed to this channel, just go ahead and click subscribe. And if you like to learn trading, trade live with me and get a funded account without risking your money, click right over here in order to learn more about my funded accounts program.